All right, now as Samsung Galaxy phone users, I'm pretty sure many of you guys do use Samsung internet browser application for browsing the internet. And you might already know that the latest new version of internet application on the One UI 8 brings in some new cool features. And of course, you can use some tricks to enable those features on the One UI 7, One UI 6.1 as well. However, let's say you want to use all those brand new features without using any tricks, then what you can do is you can download the internet beta application which is available on the Galaxy Store. Just go to the Galaxy Store, search for Samsung Internet Browser Beta. Now you can use the Samsung Internet Browser Beta as well as stable Samsung Internet Beta side by side if you want to do that. But if you want to experience those new features, new UI designs, etc., then Samsung Internet Browser Beta will be the first one to receive those experimental features and you can experience all those new features on the beta version of Samsung Internet. And this time, with this brand new update to Samsung internet browser beta, Samsung has provided all those new features which are available on the Samsung internet stable version on One UI 8. Let me tell you what I'm talking about. This is the internet beta browser here. As you can see, the latest version is 28.0.4.58 and in the change log, it says improved address bar and tab bar design, support bookmarks sorting feature, updated home page and tools menu with a new design. Now this home page and tools menu with a new design is the one which is currently available on the stable version of Samsung internet. But if you're on One UI 7 like this device is, this is the Galaxy S24 Ultra which is currently running on One UI 7 and I have installed the Samsung internet beta and I have also got the latest update on the 18th of uh, June. Let me just show you the date here, 18th of June 2025, just a few days ago. And the size of this update was huge, it's 171.58 MB and it brings in all these new features which are available on the stable version of internet application on One UI 8. And you can experience all those features on One UI 7 or 6.1 as well. Now let me show you what has changed. Let me open the application. As you can see, we have got the background here on the home page. All these icons are or the shortcuts are right here. And we do have the wallpaper background here. And we can change these background wallpapers on any devices now if you have the latest version of internet beta. For that, you need to tap on this icon. We have got change wallpaper option right here. Tap on this, allow all. And here we go. We have got featured option. We have got many different wallpapers, abstracts, minimalist, space, marine life, wildlife, cities, landscapes, flowers, pets, travel. There are plenty of wallpapers available here under each collection. You can just tap on the one that you need and just select it. As you can see, this is the background now. I can tap on done and this is how it looks. And we can of course change the wallpaper. We can pick it up from the gallery as well. We have got the gallery option here or we can also choose the colors. You can see we have got all these colors over here and let me tap on gallery. Now let's say I have got a wallpaper downloaded from uh, a particular application. I can set it up, tap on done and this is how it looks. It looks beautiful, isn't it? Now this is a feature which is available on One UI 8's internet application and now it's available on Samsung internet beta on One UI 7 as well, like I said. And the next change is the menu option here. This is the brand new menu option that you see. It's more accessible. We have got a different background here. Let me just turn on the uh, light mode. And this is how it looks. We have got this frosted glass background here. Now let me show you the regular internet application as well. Now this is the home page that you see, no background wallpaper here. And when I tap on the uh, tab here, the menu here, this is how it is. This is the older version, no frosted glass background. It's quite plain and it doesn't look that great. Whereas the newer version you can see, this is how it looks with double layered background, one with frosted glass design and the other one is a plain design. And we can also swipe towards the right to access the rest of it. And we can have the ones that we want right there on top, like history, download, save pages and settings option right here. This is pretty cool. Now let's go to bookmarks tab here. This is the bookmarks tab. Now here they have added one more new feature. When I tap on the three dot button, we now have sort button right here, which was not available on the previous version. Let me show you that. Let's go to bookmarks here. And when I tap on the three dot button here, you can see we've got edit and create folder option. Whereas on the newer version, we do have sort option, which is a brand new feature. We can sort the bookmarks by newest first, oldest first or by name. So that's another new feature that we have. These are some new changes which we now have on the latest version of the Samsung internet application. And now it is officially available on the Samsung phones running on One UI 7. You don't really have to use any tricks or you don't have to uh, download any APKs. 
you can straight away download the Samsung Internet Browser Beta on the Galaxy Store and you will be able to use all those uh, new features which are currently available on the One UI 8. I will leave a link for this application in the description below. Go ahead, click that and you can uh, go ahead and download it. Your regular Samsung Internet application will not get affected. You'll be able to use both the applications on the phone. So go ahead, check it out and let me know your thoughts about this in the comment section below. That's about it. Thanks for watching. Do not forget to hit the like button if you find this video informative and do not forget to subscribe to the channel if you want to watch more contents like this and if you want to stay updated with all the new updates, uh, tips and tricks, features, tech related news, then go ahead, subscribe and become a part of Apex community. And yeah, the wallpaper that you see here is from Volvo's application. This was recently added. You can go ahead and check it out. The link for the application is in the description. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.